Happy Monday, everyone, and happy Labor Day. Right now, high pressure well in control of our area, and it's not letting go very quickly. We headed in the middle of the week. Things could change up for the time being. High pressure in control, giving us these dry, warm conditions, and it's letting the smoke and haze really settle in, especially in the Rogue Valley and most of the valley locations, the basin included, because not a lot of winds to kind of mix it up with the rest of the atmosphere. Now we get a little later in the week. Let's go into Tuesday. You can see this ridge still built up, but also low pressure just off the coast keeping things a little more interesting. We have low pressure start to build up off of the coast of California as well. And with that, the possibility of more moisture in our atmosphere. And with that, the potential for some showers. But the showers could come with thunderstorms and with the thunderstorms lightning, with the lightning, the possibility, especially with how dry it is outside of new fire starts. Then we head into Wednesday. We head into Thursday. We see Overall, low pressure starts to break down that ridge. As that happens, we could see some cooler temperatures towards the middle to late half of the week. For your satellite radar, you can see the potential for some cloudiness out there and even a potential for some showers. But overall, what we're seeing is some sunny skies and then more on the cloudy side as we get later in the day. But with the smoke and haze that's settled into the area, well, you probably won't even see the clouds. For the coast for today, mostly sunny skies with some dense smoke. 72 for North Bend, 84 degrees though for Brookings with those offshore winds coming from the land out to the sea, keeping it a lot warmer there, but also on on some occasions rather breezy and that could increase the danger of fires out there. So red flag warning for the West Valley's dense smoke winds not as breezy. So a lot of the smoke has really settled 97 for Medford, 98 degrees for Montague and Wairika and 96 for Grants Pass. Of course, those temperatures dependent on how thick that smoke can be. And then east of the Cascades, 94 for Christmas Valley, 92 for Klamath Falls and 95 for Alturas. Your seven day forecast is showing a trend towards cooler temperatures, as I mentioned, towards Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. But with that, with some instability, we have the chance for some storms Wednesday, Thursday, Friday afternoon. We're going to see that chance in Klamath Basin as well. East of the Cascades as well. Slight chance of storms Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. Mount Shasta City going to see some storms or at least the potential of Wednesday, Thursday, Friday afternoon. And then a chance for showers as you head out towards the coast with your temperatures dropping down to around the mid 60s.